let me clear this area and let's quickly uh, define some boundary for the farmland um, yeah let's use our procedural tool for this let's use procedural object okay we don't need uh, a stone wall so we only need uh, something like a wooden wall so maybe in infinity blade blade, blade pack we have uh, we have this okay we have these things uh, not this one this uh, wooden destroyed floor objects now this one maybe this one would be good yeah what about this one wooden planks okay let's use this one as the fence let me drag and drop it here and let's start from here and I'll rotate this around x axis 90 degrees right Let me increase the distance, decrease the distance. And let's give some randomization. So yeah, here I haven't made this uh, procedural object in such a way that it finds the collision point with the ground and place on top of that. So I haven't done something like that for this, but I could do this with the trace, but I'm not going to do it here. I want to focus on the character. So.
okay I think this will be good enough for his farmland oh I'm sorry I have made this like a, this is where the wrong surface material physical material type I have made it like a mud or water surface so yeah I'll fix it later okay now this is the boundary so okay now let's paint around the area because because now I don't need soil in these areas we should save the environment Okay, um, now what? Shall we plant some crops? So, yeah, for that also we can use our advanced foliage spawner. Let me drag and drop it here. As the procedural element, I'll add uh, plant. Now we have this plant here. Let's start from this part. This is the wrong wrong type. We need a plant like this. Okay. why it doesn't uh, work in this area uh -huh, it's too high is it oh, 
let me dig a deep decency y distance x distance ah let's increase this vertical check distance no this is not it why nothing is planted in this area I think it should be the trace distance let's see okay volume height let's increase this right now it's fixed see I have done everything I need to create this now let's give some randomization to the plants let's randomize the scale from 0.6 to 1 and then what else distance shall be reduced I think 0.6 is too small do we have any other type of plant because this looks like some weed let's see No, I think this one is the best one I got at the moment. Yeah, that's okay. So let's do some rotation variation also. Otherwise, they look too homogeneous. Okay. And what else I need? Shall we add another element to this system? Well, obviously not a stone brick, something like a wooden beam. Yeah, what about this one? Some structure in the farmland. Let's add it. Okay, that's too big. And let's make it smaller. Some supporting piles to help the plants to grow. We can consider them like that if you want okay so yeah this is this guy's farmland so let me randomize them a little right so this is that guy's farmland mm, and Yeah, in the next episode, let's work on the AI for this farmer character to do some work in his little farm.